Hi, this is Stephen Hickey with GIT Get Into Technology, and in this video, I want to take you into my Mac and show you how to change my desktop background. So, stay tuned for this video. Okay, on your Mac is generally a black screen as your background of your desktop. So there's two ways of changing it. The easiest and simplest way to do this is just right click on your trackpad and then scroll down to see where it says change desktop background and left click that. And a window comes up and you can come in here and you can pick all these different colors that you want or maybe you don't see that the color you're looking for you know you can click on orange or red depending on what you're viewing there purple that looks pink uh, that looks purple um, you want to do a custom color you come down here and you click on custom color and this little box comes up on the left hand side of your screen you can do whatever color scheme you would like so you can click on green, you can click on yellow, red, deeper red, pink, and blue, oh there's a purple. You can even left click and hold, just drag around, hold it there and let it go. Uh, and then you can come down here in this little pointer here on the left hand side. You can left hold that and just move that to a darker position so it goes black. Bring it back. And you can click these little squares down here at the bottom. Okay, so that one red, black, another color red, green, orange, blue. So you get the idea how you can change your different screens to your background. Now, you can come in here and totally customize what colors you want. And just by playing around, you, there's a whole color scheme there, a spectrum of colors. And then you got pencils. You can pick whatever pencils you want. They have different names. So you want to do moss, quick moss. You want to pick grape. There's your grape. And you want to pick um, this color here. A salmon. There's a strawberry. <laughs> they go purple. And if you like that color, you can just left go right where my mouse pointer is. It's the purple. You can left click and hold and then drag it over into one of these boxes or just drag it over and drop it and now we can change the screen and click on here and there's the purple that we saved you can fill all these empty boxes up with different colors that you like so it's just an easier way of grabbing the color you want so we'll get it there you can also come down here it says iPhoto you can click on events and photos click on photos and then you can scroll through here whatever pictures you have on your computer you can um, find one that you like and we'll just bring this down and that's um, sometime in January and you see the snow on the trees and it's not you got sun and the sun's going down but you may not want the picture like that so you pick whatever picture you want in here it's going to be your picture so this gives you and enables you to just come in here and pick different pictures you can pick faces you can pick places um go under places and then you can pick a photo based on places that you've taken the photo
So we want to just pick an active desktop color. And so we're going to go back down to custom. And I want to go licorice black. This is how you basically come in here and change your desktop background. And that is the most simplest way of just right clicking and coming down here. You can also come down and click system preferences. And you can come up here to the second uh, icon, desktop screensaver. Click on that and we're right back to where we were. But it's a shortcut when you right click on your screen, you come down and click on change desktop background. So there you have it. It's very simple, straightforward. Hope you like this video. Help you to change your background to sunsets or whatever you want. A personal message to you. You can search it on Google. Uh, save it to a download folder. And then come in here and capture that photo and save it as your background. And if you do a photo, just before I leave you, if you take a photo, say that photo there of two motorcycles on the pier. It says right here, fill screen. So if you get the, to the point that you put it in and all you see is, um, you see black marks on both sides of your screen and you're like, well, I don't like that. That doesn't fill my whole screen. You want it to fill your whole screen. So you just click on this drop down menu and you can click on stretch to fill screen or you can click on fill screen. So we'll just click on fill screen. And there it is right there in front of you. Fill, your whole screen is filled. So let's go back to the color. Color scheme. Licorice. Okay, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Stay connected with GIT Get Into Technology by subscribing to this channel. It's down on the right side of this video, just below. And you also want to click on the bell notification. And any new videos that are coming out, you'll be notified. And you will be able to continue on with your learning. Um, and we have new videos coming out all the time. After watching the video, scroll down and you'll see the thumbs up. Just click on the thumbs up. And let us know that you like the video. And if you want more information on GIT Get Into Technology, you click on more and you can scroll down here. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and you continue on. Please leave us a comment on what you thought about the video, how it helped you move forward, and what problem it solved. And you can just left click and then type your message in here and come over to the far right side and click on comment. If you have any questions regarding what you've watched today or you need help with something, please leave question inside the comment section and we will answer it for you. So stay connected with GIT, get into technology.